Hey, what is up, YouTubers? We are back with the affiliate marketing case study. In the previous video, we covered how to sign up for Microsoft Advertising, aka Bing Ads, um, how to find a coupon, and how I was able to find a spend 25, get $100 coupon on the Retail Me Not website. So that was in the previous video. You can watch that by clicking the I button up there. And in this video, which is now part six of the affiliate marketing case study, we are going to be going over ad groups and keywords. So for this affiliate marketing campaign for the dog offer, um, brain training for dogs, right here, I decided that I'm going to do three ad groups and the three ad groups are going to be the affiliate page keywords. Um, as you recall from our previous uh, videos of this case study, this is the affiliates page. They have a list of 1,120 dog related keywords and I downloaded that into an Excel file. So I got that all ready to go. And then manual research, um, I'll cover that. And then uh, Bing suggested, that's what uh, BS stands for. So I'm gonna get started, and um, and I'm gonna get started with the first ad group, with which is the affiliate page keywords. So I'm gonna name this affiliate page, or yeah, affiliate page keywords, and then I'm going to put it on broad. And now, and remember, once you click this link on the affiliate page, it'll automatically download an Excel file right into right onto your computer. Um, so I got that and keep in mind that you can only upload a thousand keywords at a time. So I'm going to stop at 999. Oh, okay. Where are we right there? Oh, I didn't mean to cut that. Alrighty. So now there is, um, technically 998 keywords. Um, all related on how to train a dog. So we'll see that we'll see if the affiliate page keywords is a good ad group. We'll be testing that. And then the next ad group I'm going to create is oops, okay, so we got that done. The next one we're gonna do is manual. And I already went and got a few um, keywords uh, doing manual research. And to do this type of manual research, all you have to do, I mean, it is so simple. All you gotta do is go to the Bing or Yahoo search bar and type in dog, if you're promoting a dog offer, and then just see what pops up underneath it. And then just look to see what the top searches are. Because once you start uh, typing in a phrase, the most popular searches are gonna come first. So you can just get good ideas from that. So I came up with uh, this list of keywords um, and I'm gonna import these on phrase match. So if someone types in dog training for Huskies, um, my ad will show up and it'll be the dog training keyword on phrase match that triggered the impression. Okay, so I'm just gonna highlight these. And I'd say that this took me like probably three to five minutes to find this little list here. Um, I'm going to paste this plain text and then I will label this manual phrase and one thing I could do is come over here and put these quotations at the end of every keyword and at the beginning because then that automatically um, puts them at phrase match so you can do that or you can just upload all the keywords and come back afterwards and then um, select them all and change them to phrase. Uh, you can do either or. So the quotations is phrase match and then the brackets, like dog training. That is an exact match keyword, um, but I'm not gonna use that right now. I usually only use exact match when, after I test uh, some keywords and then find some winning keywords, then I usually put them on exact match with an increased bid. Okay, so I'm just gonna get all this stuff. Okay, so that was the manual phrase ad group and we are done with that and now Bing suggested and I really like uh, doing the Bing suggested um, ad groups just because it is so easy to do and I'll show you how to do that right now. Bing suggested and then I can just come over here, click on 
um, all these suggestions uh, click into the keywords so and then they give you rough estimates of the monthly searches and the monthly average cost per click so you can get a good idea and they also have competition so you can get a good idea on um, how much it'll cost roughly to get a good position and then I will add to the Bing suggested ad group and then I can just keep coming down there's 126 in this and I'll add those as well um, then I'll do pet game and then dog game uh, one more one more and then I will wrap it up okay so I'd have to say there's probably close to like 200 to 300 keywords in that so that's how easy it was to set up three ad groups and we kept everything organized so once we get our whole campaign up and running and we start getting traffic we can see which of these ad groups is resulting in sales so that is it for this video in the next video we're going to be covering uh, part three of the Bing ads creation process which is creating ads and ad extensions so we'll be covering that in the next video um, lastly if you are not subscribed to my youtube channel yet come on come on smack that subscribe button and that notification bell to stay up to date with all my future videos and i will see you guys in part seven of the case study.